Welcome, welcome, welcome to uh, Season 2.1 Finals. Cerberus versus OKI. Best 2 of 3. Uh, getting it underway. Uh, Cerberus has already banned out Esmeralda and Kimmy, where OKI has banned out uh, Uranus and Claude. Uh, so we'll have to see, uh, see how that goes. Cerberus uh, going for an early Thamus pick. Thamus is very, very dangerous. Very, very dangerous. Good hero, good hero pick. And uh, OKL will respond with... Two mystery heroes. I wonder who they're going to get. Um, OKL playing so good in their first two games. Like, they're really, really put together. But uh, Cerberus has brought it this week, too. They were they were falling back a little bit in that second game, but they came back and just crushed the competition. Uh, both teams as well. Both teams as well have been doing things. Uh, aggressive plays. Aggressive early on. That's a Bruno's Hylos combination from the side of OKL. That's going to be super dangerous in the uh, in the early in the mid game with the Hylos. Hylos slowing them down and Bruno just following behind and kicking the endless soccer ball at them. So that's pretty that's pretty rough. However, Selena going to be able to get in behind Hylos and burst down uh, Bruno if, if she plays it right. And uh, there's some anti there's some more anti Hylos from uh, uh, from Jawhead able to uh, out position him pretty easily. So we'll just have to see how that goes. Also, uh, his ult doesn't uh, also ignore his launch pad. That's a, that's a pretty good pick from uh, Cerberus. Good draft so far, guys, from uh, Cerberus and OKL. I'm liking it. Uh, Selena gonna be doing gonna be doing a lot of damage. We'll see if they try to steal uh, steal buffs. And there's an export pick from the side of OKE or the side of OKL of OKL. I like it. We'll see. Uh, we'll see how they uh, how they respond to that. I'm sure that they'll respond well. With uh, let's see, ban phase. Cerberus does not have any tanks yet. Uh, they've been liking to pick the Grok even into Hylos, so we'll have to see if they if they go Groky Grok here. Um, otherwise, if uh, yep, I was gonna say otherwise, if OKL has been realizing that, then they're gonna then they're gonna ban Grok. Uh, OKL though, OKL has been doing extremely well with. Yeah, they have such a big hero pool is the problem. Uh, probably a Carmella uh, for their other offlane position. That might be a good ban because Carmella does really good. Farce, that's right. OKL has been doing really well with Farce as well. It's a fair ban. Uh, okay, I'll might go Alucard. We saw an Alucard earlier in this uh, tournament. Kaja. Nope, that's a Kaja. Okay. Kaja, also a really, really good uh, pick. So much crowd control, able to outposition just about anybody. Uh, ooh, there's no Atlas counters yet. That is, There's no Atlas counters yet. That's a huge play. Atlas into Thamus is so big. It's so big. We'll see if that forces OKL to pick a uh, Diggy for their last pick. Nope, they're going to go Kufra instead of Atlas. Uh, which is interesting because... I mean, Xborg is really like the only one. Xborg's really the only one that can uh, get out of Kufra. Maybe, uh, maybe uh, Bruno too a little bit, but Bruno doesn't rely on his uh, his blink slide too much, and he can uh, he can just wait out ball. So we'll see we'll see how that goes. Interesting interesting pick on the Kufra, and it does look like we're gonna have an uh, an off lane Carmella. Awesome. And that's a oh that's an Angela pick. That's an Angela support instead of Diggy. Uh, Angela's gonna be really good at jumping into uh, Xborg or Bruno, or Hylos, but you know you don't really need to uh, jump into Hylos. He's so tanky as it is. So uh, if he's able to help out that Bruno, uh, we're gonna see some uh, see some big plays. All right, guys, I'm ready to get underway. Game one of three, OKL versus Cerberus. Good luck, contenders. Season two point one, Telecast XWAS official, in house online tournament. <laughs> That's a mouthful. That is a mouthful. I think I need a catchier name for that. X X one, X two, X three. I don't know. X Borg. All right, guys. On the side of servers, we have Thamus, Kufra, Selena, Jawhead, and Granger versus Angela, X Borg, Kaja, Hylos, and Bruno from OKL. They're gonna clash. They're gonna bash. They're gonna be done in a flash. Probably not. But uh, good luck to these teams, man. Good luck to these teams. Got to get it underway. What you saying today? Hey, welcome, 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 everybody. Let's get it. All right, here we go. Uh, right off the bat, we see Thamus uh, coming in the mid lane. It looks like they're going to try to get some uh, early aggression here on the uh, OKL team. Meanwhile, OKL doing a one, possibly doing a one three one, but Bruno uh, hanging back to get red buff off the bat. Very, very interesting. Thamus going to be uh, going to be bursting down this creep wave very, very quickly, uh, especially with Cooper there on his heels. Uh, however. 
Cerberus doing uh, doing the same thing. They're also taking uh, red buff first. That's uh, that's quite interesting. Selena not even going into contest, and uh, looks like they're wanting to go squishy next. However, Bruno is going to be able to uh, rotate uh, south after that to go uh, go take squishy. Not if uh, not if TJ gets in there and just takes it first, and they uh, they get both squishies, and now they're trying to invade the blue buff. Cerberus playing so fast paced. I like it. Already already playing that early aggression. Uh, that's a, that's a hyper buffed on Granger. They got one blue buff, one red buff. Their blue buff has not been touched. Xborg trying to do his best to, uh, help, th help them control the lanes, but, uh, Thamus, meanwhile, he's gonna go top and, uh, just take up all this farm. Oh, there's a pause. Uh, we need to pause. Lots of pauses. I think every single game that, uh, OKL has played in, there's been a pause. Every single game, which is okay. Which is okay. It happens sometimes. Hey guys, while I've got your attention, don't forget to uh, like this video, follow this page, share the video, come say hi, man, all that stuff, all that stuff. And uh, thank you, big thanks to the star senders, Steph David, Aaron, Reggie, um, who else? Uh, Aaron Zeke, Australian Aaron, we'll have to call him AA, uh, Justin Venezuela, and uh, Mark, Danielle, and Joe, thank you so much, Joe. Just Joe. Okay. Uh, that's not how, uh, that's not how giveaways work around here, my friend. Lawrence, or not Lawrence, sorry, that's not how giveaways work, Kurt. Just relax, relax, man. TJ, oh my gosh, Yeet Laid says, good luck, TJ Morris, and sent 25 stars our way. Thank you so much, Yeet Laid. Big shout out to Yeet Laid. I appreciate that. Awesome. Very, very awesome. Go, Reiner. Oh, is that one of the other uh, players? It's possible. That is possible. Reiner. All right. Undoubtedly, indubitably, going to be at the top of the sea, rocking it like the ocean. Don't stop about all the commotion. Bop, bop, boppity bop. All right, how's it going, fam? Welcome back. Getting in the van. X Y's fam in the back of the van. We're gonna pack it in. We're never gonna try to pretend. All right. Um, oops. All right, we're gonna try it there. We'll see if uh, if that's been enough time for them. We'll see if anybody's uh still. No, it looks like everybody's moving and fine to go now. Okay, where were we after that that dreadful pause? TJ says start. Okay. Uh, big big uh Kufra jump in, but a little bit risky. A little bit risky. Selena not quite there to back him up. Level two only. Level two only on the uh, on the Bruno and Granger going in with a big ultimate. Uh, big stun. Big stun on Hylos. That's first blood. Uh, Selena managing to get first blood. Lots of damage coming out from Hylos. Or lots of damage going to Hylos coming from Granger. Uh, Kufra able to get out of there just in time. Uh, Bruno falling so far behind on farm. So far behind. That's already an extra 1k advantage to the side of uh, Cerberus. And let's see how... Uh, Let's see how uh, Granger is building his item. Let's let's go on Bruno Cam, see if he, if he's able to deal with uh, Selena here. Uh, however, oh, a little bit of a whiff, a little bit of a whiff from uh, from Granger. Uh, so Bruno's gonna be able to get out of there. Bruno only with a hundred knife so far, only with a hundred knife. Whereas uh, Granger, uh, two extra items, uh, already accelerating towards that that beautiful Reaper Machete. Uh, big initiation from Kufra. Uh, we'll see if uh, Granger really wants this, but I don't think he's got ult up quite yet. Yes, he does. He's gonna be able to. He's gonna be able to drop the Bruno. Oh my gosh, that's huge! Bruno's not even level four yet, and he's died one time. Oh, he's gonna be so slow on his farm. I mean, that's kind of what he's got to do though, because uh, late game Bruno's gonna out carry, um, out carry Granger. So uh, Granger's gonna have to do his best to uh, to kill him. Oh my gosh! Oh, I thought that was a big stun. That was close. It's close to being a big stun. Selena. Uh, let's see what she tries to do here. Uh, Bruno looking for, uh, looking for, um, 
the red buff, but Green, uh, Kufra might be able to get in there soon enough. That's a huge stun from Selena. Selena going back in. Kuf, uh, Kaja's super low, but there's enough of them to uh, scare off the Selena. Oh, Selena almost got another big stun. Uh, Kaja does have ult, is able to drag Karina in, or able to grab, drag Selena in, and Selena's going to drop to Bruno. That's going to help Bruno uh, catch back up off on this. Absolutely. Absolutely. I just bumped something with my chair. Sorry, table. Uh, oops. Uh, Jawhead. Jawhead getting a kill um, on uh, Hylos. And uh, now we see... Uh, now we see Bruno going for... Uh, now we see uh, Granger going for Bruno. I'm sorry, guys. I'm getting a little bit tired. Um, Granger now uh, rotating back to the top lane. Trying to get it. Trying to bring the pain in the top lane. Keep them from going insane in their membrane. Um, looks like uh, Granger going gunner for the Lord. They might be able to get it uncontested. Uh, Servers TJ hiding in the bushes. Oh, we might see uh, Xborg try to ult. He's not going to try to ult to go steal Lord. He wasn't able to get there in time. And uh, meanwhile, uh, poor Bruno just falls further and further behind. He's only at eight sixteen hundred, whereas uh, Bruno, whereas a uh, Granger, is at uh, is about two thousand seven hundred. And uh, that's a lot of damage going off on Hylos. Hylos is going to be able to get out of there. Big ult from Kaja. Kaja dragging a. Uh, Kaja dragging, Bruno or uh, Kaja dragging Frank Granger in. Ah, uh, but they're not going to be able to quite find the kill there on Granger. Granger's able to get out of there. Uh, there's a lot of damage going out on uh, Xborg, but Xborg's going to get out of there not without popping his armor, so he'll still have ult for this next fight that's about to come up. And uh, Granger uh, staying a little bit greedy, but, you know, he's uh, he's just farming. He's doing his thing. All good. All good. Hey, what's up, Marpai? What's up, Jake? Joko, good to see you guys. Thanks again, Yeet Laid, for, uh, for the stars. I really appreciate it. da 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 And uh, Jawhead doing a good job at uh, helping Granger push. Granger looked like, looks like he might be able to gun down this tower. Bruno and Hylos trying to come to defend. They're not going to be able to get there in time. Granger going for the buff. Uh, Selena manages to steal her buff. Granger has ult. Let's see if he if he unleashes it or not. One, two, three. Not a whole lot of damage where it was needed, but uh, Kaja quite low. It's going to be difficult for him to, uh, to jump in now. Uh, Xborg. Xborg doing a lot of, getting a lot of heat damage onto the... Uh, Onto the Kufra, and he's gonna be able to drop the Kufra, but uh, in the back line, Granger was able to drop Hylos, and now they're gonna try to uh, they're gonna try to keep uh, keep up the pressure. Um, lots of lots of towers destroyed by Cerberus. Cerberus gets uh, tier one and tier two in the top in the middle lane. Uh, Selena seeing what she can do to uh, cut creep wave or uh, you know try to get some vision on the enemies. Meanwhile, uh, OT OKL, they're uh, they're uh, going back to farm. A big stun from Selena. I don't think that she's gonna be able to follow that up though. She is gonna help uh, this Granger, however, take the uh, take the beautiful uh, beautiful turtle. And uh, let's see, Selena setting up for another stun. Whiffs it. Oh, just barely, just barely misses. Uh, Bruno was uh, anticipating that and he was able to get out in time. And let's see what else is going on. Bruno uh, struggling to catch back up on farm. He's at 3k right now, but uh, that's a 2k disadvantage from the the Granger, who is just. Uh, Magnificently farmed, and uh, Selena able to get the kill there. Able to get the kill there. Let's see uh, what emblem are we running on Granger. Granger is running marksman, so it's a little unfortunate that Kale that Selena took that kill because uh, she is not running marksman, or, uh, not running bounty hunter. And uh, bounty hunter would have given Granger quite quite a distinct gold advantage. However, uh, Cerberus is about six thousand ahead of this uh, OKL team, who uh, OKL has been playing so well today. Um, and Xborg uh, getting another kill on uh, on bottom lane on the uh, jawhead. And it uh, looks like uh, Angela's going to be able to get out of there. That's impressive. Kufra not giving up without a chase, though. That's fair, especially with how low she is. And, uh, yep, she's out of there. She is out of there. That's a killing speed for Bruno. Bruno is able to drop uh, Thamus. Granger is still alive, though, but just barely. Oh, my gosh. And uh, Bruno drops Granger. Holy cats. Holy cats! That's gonna bring Grain or Bruno back into this game a little bit. He's uh, still about uh, 1,200 farm behind, but it uh, looks like he's trying to get his blue buff. Uh, Selena's gonna be able to steal that again from him, though. Selena is gonna be able to steal that from him again. All right. Interesting. 
And now uh, let's throw it on to the uh, the Selena cam. She might be trying to do some uh, some big plays here. Oh, sorry, 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 sorry. That's okay. That's okay. Sorry, sorry, teams. I was trying to switch my camera angle and I and I paused it by accident. All right, Bruno cam. Bruno's getting back up to level ten. Uh, Granger though, just hitting level twelve. About to go take his buffs. Full Reaper Machete. Let's check out their builds. Let's check out their builds while we stay on Granger cam. So uh, Granger currently building uh, Endless Battle, it would appear. And he's already got his uh, Blade of uh, Despair and um, full Reaper Machete and cooldown boots. Whereas uh, whereas Bruno building a little bit differently. Uh, Endless Battle coming out first with uh, Reaper Machete and attack speed boots. So uh, we'll, see. we'll see how that works out for him. Uh, looks like they might try to uh, contest this Lord this time. There's to contest this turtle. Uh, yeah, Exborg being able to get in there and uh, ult off on the turtle. However, big set from Kufra. Oh my goodness. Four-man stun from Kufra. That's going to be two down on the side of KTL. Soon to be three. Exborg, not quite dead. Bruno still in the back line, staying alive. Uh, is, uh, is Granger going to be able to find this? Yeah, Granger's able to find that, uh, that, sh that Bruno. That's uh, four of them dead. Uh, Exborg gets dead in the background. That's a wipeout. OTK, or... Uh, OKL losing uh, five, all five of their heroes. And uh, Cerberus only moving, losing one. Let's see if they push up. They might be able to take an inhibitor turret here. If uh, if Khan, uh, or if, uh, let's see, Hylos and Kaja are both back up. So we'll see if they're able to uh, to defend against this onslaught from Cerberus. Um, that's a little bit of a missed ult from Kaja. A little bit of a, a sad opportunity there. Uh, Granger determined to do, uh, do more damage, but... The entirety of their team is back up. It looks like they're going to go uh, hang out at this buff, though. It's almost up in, like, about 10 seconds. And uh, Thamus continuing to farm really well. And uh, a little bit unpresent in uh, some of these team fights. But once he gets his second skill off near the enemies, I mean, he's going to be able to rip them up. Rip them up good. Absolutely. Kaja uh, should have ult up in about 30 seconds. So that's going to be a little bit hard for uh, for Granger to do his next uh, hard push. Hopefully they're able to uh, take this red away from Bruno, though. That'd be a huge, that'd be a huge, huge deal. And uh, they are able to. They are able to. Uh, Granger going for Kaja. Kaja able to just casually uh, slide through the wall, though, because uh, he's a bird. Birds can fly. You know how it goes. You know how it goes. All right. Hey, thank you for uh, clipping that. Thank you for clipping that, Justin. I'm not 100% sure what you clipped, but... Oh, it must have been the Savage. Big plays. Oh, my gosh. Big jump from Kufra. Big jump from Kufra again. And... Uh, Granger there with the backup. Granger going to be able to drop the tier 2. It looks like they're going to go in. Big damage. Hylos might drop here. Hylos drops to Jawhead. Uh, Granger getting really aggressive. Going on the front line. Going on the front line. And uh, meanwhile, Selena pushing the mid lane. Uh, it looks like uh, Cerberus wanting to back up here and get the Lord. While there is uh, two down on the side of on the side of OKL. Oh my goodness. Go, go, go. Uh, and uh, Cerberus just doing so much damage to the Lord at this point. So over-farmed. They've got a 10k gold advantage at 11 minutes. Uh, OKL not even able to contest this Lord. Not even able to contest this Lord. However, let's see what's going on in the top lane. Jawhead pushing, farming. That's an immortality on Jawhead. That's going to help him out a lot when he initiates these fights. Sorry, that's going to help him out a lot when he initiates these fights. <clears throat> Uh, so hopefully he does uh, does well there. And uh, Kufra looking for his next big set. Uh, meanwhile, Granger playing that farm game. He's uh, he's already critting for uh, 2,400, though. Let's, uh, let's see what his build is. I'm very, very excited to see how that's been coming along. He just finished. Uh, he just finished on this battle, and now it looks like he's winning, uh, working on possibly Wind of Nature. But we'll have to see uh, more as that develops. Granger uh, able to get in there, do quite a bit of damage. Lord also helping them push. Uh, they are able to drop the middle tower. Uh, they might be able to pop, uh, immortality on... Oh, nope. Oh, my gosh. Bruno shuts down, uh, Granger with a big ultimate from Kaja. But, during all that chaos, uh, Selena and Jawhead able to go top and take the, uh, tier 3, the inhibitor turn on the top lane. Uh, and Jawhead also, uh, looking to get the, uh, tier 3 on the bot, but not gonna be able to quite get there. Cerberus, uh, TJ a little bit out of position, but he's gonna be able to take the, uh, they're gonna try to take the, uh, the buff away from, uh, from the OKL team here. But red buff is up. Bruno's going to be able to go get that one. That's a little unfortunate for uh, for Cerberus. But, I mean, Bruno's still uh, about 14, 1,400 gold behind uh, Granger, <clears throat> which is quite a big gap. We'll see if, uh, if Bruno's able to, able to close that anytime soon. 
Meanwhile, uh, Exborg almost has his armor back up for uh, for one ultimate, and then he'll uh, he might go back to heal up. It's hard to say. You don't always need to go back with Exborg. You don't always need to go back with Exborg because his uh, passive that refills your uh, refills your armor bar is super good. So Granger with no buffs, red buff almost up, but oh, big stun from Selena. We'll see if uh, Kufra jumps in there. That's a uh, popped Exborg shield. He's still going to have a uh, ultimate once he re resurrects. If he resurrects, that is. And uh, Kufra not wanting to go win on this just yet. That's fair. Meanwhile, Thamus just uh, pushing like a madman in the bottom lane. Trying his best to uh, offset the uh, farm that Bruno's been getting uh, lately off of the, uh, the Granger kill. That that caught the Bruno up so, so much. Like now he's only, he's only about 1,000 behind now. So he's uh, continuing to close that gap. Bruno... Bruno will be such a difficult hero for Granger to deal with late game. Uh, there's no sight. Did I mess up the sight? I'm sorry. Did I did I mess something up? I apologize, chat. All right, and then uh, Thomas just uh, hanging out in the bottom lane. Still, I like it. Uh, Granger, a fair bit behind him. They're uh, they're thinking about getting aggressive, but honestly, they just need to get a good uh, they need to get a good stun off. They need to get a good stun off with the the Selena monster. Uh, that way, they can try to go up and push. Or oh, okay, I was gonna say, or if Kufra gets super aggressive and gets another beautiful four man ult, that would be awesome. But maybe next time, maybe next time. Okay, that's just fine. It's just fun. Uh, best of three, bro. Yes, it is, Charles. Yes, it is, Charles. Uh, looks like this is uh, dragging a little bit. Dragging a little bit. They need to. They need to get a lucky uh, ult. Not a lucky ult, but just a uh, a reasonable ult. Let's see if Kufra goes in. Ah, oh, Kufra does not go in. I was excited to see him try to uh, try to jump on that. Meanwhile, Granger just uh, taking their buffs away from them. I like it. Uh, might be gunning for uh, for Lord now. I oh, would help them uh, absolutely get the Lord in their base, and they'd at least be able to take the uh, the last inhibitor. At which point they have got uh, a lot easier time going high ground. So we'll see how they do that. But I mean, the more and more that the late, the more and more late this game goes, the stronger and stronger Br Bruno's gonna get. So uh, we'll have to see uh, see how that works out for our uh, our good pal Granger. All right, and uh, looks like uh, TJ might be in trouble here, but Kufer doing his best to save him. I'm sorry, TJ might or um, Jawhead might be in trouble, but uh. Cooper doing his best to save him is able to save him, and uh, Granger able to get uh, a kill off of that. However, Thamus did die up there. Thamus did die up there, which is a little bit unfortunate. And as long as we keep distance from Bruno, <coughs> Granger might be able to take care of him. It doesn't look like it though. And that's another miss on the stun from Selena. That must, that's got to hurt, man. That has got to hurt. But while all this is getting pushed, Bruno is going to go into the bottom lane and uh, take that tower down. And possibly that Kaja? I oh, don't know. He's backing up quite far. His frontliners are right there, though, to back him up. It's a little bit unfortunate. A uh, big, big hit on the uh, on the Bruno. He'll probably have to back. No, no. He'll have enough life steal from the, uh, the creeps. Oh, that's fine. That's fine. Okay. Um, so that's all the inhibitors down on the side of, uh, OKL, but their, uh, their defense game is so, so strong. It's oh, so strong. All right. Uh, bro, championship game, North America. Yeah, yeah. Uh, go check out my, uh, telecast X-Ways, my, sorry, my telecast x -Was, um, uh, North America server tournament, tournaments. I do, uh, Call of Duty Mobile as well as, uh. Mobile Legends, mobile, uh, there. So uh, yeah, go check that out for all the uh, the news and the information about my North America server tournament. Absolutely. So, um, well, this is exciting. So I feel like not a lot's happened for the last like seven minutes. But Granger waiting patiently, trying to get a little bit of a sneak attack. That would be good. And uh, ooh, big stun from Selena. Let's see if that's uh, gonna be enough for her to go in. It's not gonna be quite enough for her to go in and uh, do big things off of. 
But uh, maybe we'll see a uh, epic epic group up from uh, Cerberus here, and they'll try to uh, try to put this game away. They are twelve thousand gold. They've got a twelve thousand gold lead. They should be able to win this fight uh, if played properly. But they're not sticking too too well together. They are, however, doing a great job at keeping uh, pressure on this base. Like all three lanes have got creeps going in all the time. That's good. That is very very good for Cerberus. Let's switch to the Bruno cam. Let's see how Bruno's doing. You think Bruno's having a good day? We're about to find out. Look at that smile. He's having a good day. And that's a... Uh, oh, that's a power potion on the side of Granger. Granger's full built now. Granger is full built. I wonder if he's going to want to go on that. Go on with that. Yeah, he does have... He's got wind nature. Wind of nature. So that's going to be uh, really, really good against their... Um, their Bruno. It's going to defend a lot of damage. So hopefully we can see them uh, come in here soon and uh, battle them up, man. Fight for our amusement. Fight for our amusement. Yeah, absolutely, Joe. You can welcome welcome to the Xbox fam. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Hashtag Xbox fam. Thanks, Charles. Appreciate it, man. Oh, no. Xborg dropped a uh, Granger. That is not good. Bruno is in the background doing a lot of damage. That's another drop from Bruno. Oh no. Is this going to be three? Angela is able to drop Thamus. Kufra trying real hard to get out of there. Uh, Export going back in, or not Export, Jahad going back in to re engage. Uh, Selena, though, going uh, trying to wrap around to the bottom, maybe trying to backdoor. Selena might be able to get the win here. Oh my goodness. Yeah, they're all middle. They're all middle. Selena going mid by, or going bottom by herself. I don't know why she's, uh, why she's scared of this Hylos. Hylos is the only one there. She could have tried to do uh, do some damage, but I suppose not. I suppose not. Double kill. Oh, Xborg, man. He's on fire. He's on fire. How to make, uh, how to join the tournament. Uh, go check the information on my Telecast Xbox page for uh, for North America tournament or for Southeast Asia. For Southeast Asia, just go go check on my posts and my pages. All the information that you guys need is going to be over there. Absolutely. Oh, there we go. All right. Uh, the enemy team has called out Lord. Okay. Yeah. Okay. L man, they are contenders. They've got to be uh, they've got to be a little bit careful here because one slip up and uh, the enemies could uh, just go in and backdoor because they have no more inhibitors like Thamus or Granger, Selena even. They've got a lot of heroes that are capable of doing it. Absolutely. Jawhead not so so much, but still a not not terrible Jawhead. Okay, there we go. They're going for it. They got Lord in the base. Oh my gosh. Okay, why? Oh my gosh, okay, why? Taking game one. That's awesome. Let's go to game two. So excited. So excited. Good, good, good game, guys. Good game. 